Welcome back Commanders, my name is Tim and in this video we take a look at the Legendary Edition screenshot versus the Allot modded version. I've scoured the internet, uh, well mostly the Mass Effect Forever Discord server to show you these wonderful images of Mass Effect Legendary Edition. It's a brilliant Discord server and if you're a fan I highly recommend you pop along and you say hello. Now the Legendary Edition massively enhances the original Mass Effect base game, as you can see from these two images. But the Allot mod which can be found on the Nexus website covers all three games and boasts over 20,000 textures covering everything from the characters to the environments to even the weapons and armors, a total of 40 gig over the entire trilogy, so you're looking at a hefty amount of detail. However, although it looks like it's a no-brainer against the base game, I want to know how the Legendary Edition compares to the modded version of the game. All we have to go on at the moment are these images, my version of Mass Effect Trilogy is modded, so rest assured I'll be doing an entire video comparing the actual games once it's released, so if you're not subscribed, do so now so you won't miss it. Alright, let's have a game. Five sets, one point per set. One of these images is the Allot modded version, and one is the Legendary Edition. A or B. Okay, here's your second set of images. Which one is the Legendary Edition, and which is the Allot modded version? A or B. And your third set of images. Which one's the Legendary Edition, and which one is the Allot modded version? A or B. Okay, here's your fourth set of images. Which one's the Legendary Edition and which one is the Lot modded version? A or B? And your last set. A bit more tricky this one. One is the original, one is the Legendary Edition and the other is the Lot modded version. A, B or C? So, how do you think you did? Are you confident? Alright, let's check those results. One point per set, keep track of your score. So here's the first one. Correct answer is B. Some of them you can see there's a real improvement to the characters. For example in this one, Anderson looks so much more crisper and brighter. Okay, so next one. This one's a little bit more tricky. Correct answer is B, and you can tell that by the improved detail on Edie's shoulders. For the third set, this is the greatest villain of the Mass Effect universe, and he's actually your boss in Mass Effect 2. And it's all about the lighting in this one. Correct answer is A, and it's the modded one that has the softer lighting. Fourth set, Okay, so I really struggled with this one when I first saw it, and I promptly got shut down in flames when I voiced my opinion in the Discord server, so I'm interested to see how you did. Correct answer is B, and it comes down to the lighting again, and here you can see it's got a sharper detail as well. And so for the final set, I threw in that extra image of the base game original just to try and throw you off a little bit. So along with the modded version and the legendary version, did you guess right? Correct answer there was A. I'll give you a bonus point if you got them all correct, with the modded version being B, and the original being C. So if you enjoyed that little quiz, let me know by hitting that like button and tell me down in the comments, did you get six out of six? And if you did get any wrong, which one was it? Come on, Miranda, enough with the quizzes. So to me, there's a massive difference between the original and the legendary edition, but not so much between the legendary edition and the lot modded versions, which is a real testament to the people behind the mod. But remember, this is just a very, very, very small sample size of what the full game's going to be. And these are just images as well, so it's not going to be showing anywhere near the true extent of the remaster. If you only own the base game, or you're on console, then the Legendary Edition is going to be a must-buy. Looking at these two images, you can see the high level of detail that's gone into improving Ashley. Yet with images like this one, it's just more of a sharpening of the image quality, which is understandable. Mass Effect 3 came out six years after Mass Effect 1, and so Mass Effect 1 is in need of the most work, but it's also going to be a full price game, which, in all fairness, you're getting three games for the price of one. But if that's not affordable right now, and you're on PC, then this mod might be the next best thing. To see everything we know about the Legendary Edition, click the links on screen now. Thank you to Nerdy Dude on Patreon for your support, and I'll see you next time. Commander. Commander.